Hi, Amy with another short about how to take care of your shoreline home. I'm out here on Vashon Island with King Conservation District. They're planting native plants as part of a shore-friendly restoration project. Let's go learn more about the plants they're planting and why they picked those. So we're planting 378 native plants today. There are trees, shrubs, ground covers, and 16 species overall. When planting at your home, be sure to think about right plant, right place. What are the sun conditions like? What are the soil moisture conditions like? Here we're planting the back end of the beach. These plants are tolerant of water and salt spray. When selecting and placing your plants, it's also good to think about what plants might help retain your soil and slow erosion. So when you have steep slopes, you really want a mix of trees, shrubs, and then ground covers as well. You can maintain a view corridor by intentionally layering your plants based on their height. So here we've placed ground cover species and then slowly transitioned into short shrubs and then taller shrubs along the edges. If I could tell a landowner one thing about planting native plants, it would be that it's not just good for the environment, but it's good for them too. It brings many benefits. Birds and other pollinators that they can enjoy, berries that they can eat, and they can also help protect shorelines and steep slopes from erosion. Get to know native plants on shorefriendlykingcounty.org and schedule a site visit if you need more help. Thanks for watching.